kiteboarding. I want to show you the NP Golf Bag 165 size. Uh, this is the same bag as the Cabrina model with different label. Obviously, it has an embroidered NP on it. NP is Neo Pride. Neo Pride is the parent company for Cabrina. The Cabrina bag is actually a little more expensive than this one, and it's the exact same bag besides the logo. So I want to show you this one because this is what's great about it. It's a 165 size, and you can fit in your light wind board. I just pulled out a Nobile Flying Carpet 160 by 46. Fits in here just fine. That's so if you need to take your lighter wind board on a trip and you don't want to get skunked on your trip, you can fit that in there and still have plenty of room for kites. Other good things about this bag is that the top is padded, the sides are padded, and the bag pockets are padded. So if you want to put your fins or whatever in here, this is also padded. You don't have to use your actual kite for padding. The bottom of the bag has a zipper cover, a handle down here for grabbing it, but this is also like a Cordura with plastisol over it, roller blade style wheels on it, double zip, so you can zip from the top, zip from the bottom, and bring it up, and close it, handle, and the back, of course, down low here has the plastic rails and padded all the way, including the top. So if you need a bigger bag, this is the bag to have, the NP-165. It also comes in a 150 model, same bag, just smaller, and a 140. So if you plan on having just a smaller board with you and you don't need the extra space, you can get the smaller bag. I think this bag is actually worth the extra cost. There are some other bags in the market we've tried that don't have padded tops where you'd have to use your kite as the padding. Uh, not too enthusiastic about that. This is the best, most overbuilt one. Yeah, it maybe adds a pound to the total bag weight, but to protect your gear, I think that's a, a valuable trade-off. Again, if you're interested, adventurekiteboarding.com. Thank you very much.